So today I want to talk about the idea of you know going with the flow. Um, when a lot of people start to learn about one of our mindset pillars, which is acceptance, they start to think that it's just kind of like a yeah, I'm the kind of person that just goes with the flow, you know, yeah, cool, you, you broke up with me, yeah, let's just go with the flow, oh, cool, you want to call me up at 2 a.m. for a booty call, awesome, let's go with the flow, and um, that's not what we're talking about at all. Uh, first of all, I, I have a problem with the whole notion of go with the flow. Uh, first of all, everyone thinks that they're the type of person who goes with the flow. Um, even the most anal retentive, stuck up, hard ass people in the world think that they go with the flow. Um, because they don't. They, n n nobody really goes with the flow. Going with the flow is really just a way that, that people talk when they just don't want to make a decision. They don't want to take the initiative. They don't want to take the lead. They're like, yeah, I'm just the kind of guy who just goes with the flow. Where do you want to go for lunch? I don't know where I want to go. Where do you want to go for lunch? Do you want to go anywhere in particular? No, not me. I don't want to go anywhere in particular. Let's just go. I'm down for whatever. Let's just, I'll just go with whatever. Yeah, let's, where should we go for lunch? I don't know. And, you know, you just have these like mind-numbing, annoying conversations that just go on in circles forever because no one is really willing to make a decision because everyone is just going with the flow. It's the most meaningless thing in the world, going with the flow. Um, and what I'm not advocating is that you just go with the flow, that you're there at your ex's beck and call. If they, if they you know, decide that, oh, the guy I really want to date is not available on Friday night because he's out banging 12 other women or something. So I'm going to call up my ex who's a plan B and, you know, he'll go with the flow and we'll hang out because he's like this uh, little trained puppy dog who will, who's so desperate to get back together with me that, that you know, he'll do anything because he'll just go with the flow. That's not what I'm telling you to do at all. I'm telling you to have integrity. I'm telling you to, to really believe in what you want and to value yourself enough to go after what you want. Um, and, and acceptance is not about going with the flow. It's about simply not resisting what's happened. Because a lot of people create suffering in their lives when they resist what happens, when they resist the breakup. They're like, oh, we should have never broken up. Why should you have never broken up? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter whether or not you should or shouldn't have broken up because you did break up. And as long as you resist that, you're going to create emotional suffering in your life. What's better, what's more effective, what's more productive is to say, okay, we broke up, I get that, but what do I want to do about it now? And that's not go with the flow. That's simply accepting what happened. That's simply accepting the results that you got in life and saying, okay, based on what actually happened, what do I want to do from here? Where do I want to go? Do I want to get back together? Do I want to call them? Do I want to distance myself and give them that space that they asked for? Do I want to improve myself so I can show to them that I really am the kind of person that they want to be in a relationship with, that I know that we can have together uh, a, a great relationship uh, together? Is that what you want to do? And that is not going with the flow. That's not just like, yeah, Wherever life leads me, that's where I am. I'm just kind of sitting on the river, and if this river goes off a waterfall, whatever, man, I'm just going with the flow. No, you, you, need, to, you need to actually have values and stick with them and, and set the tone for your own life and live your own life and not just go with the flow, not just randomly end up wherever life spits you out. That, that's not what I'm advocating in the slightest. I want you to really direct your own life and to really set course on what you want and to really go after it. That is what I'm hoping through all of these mindset pillars that you take away from that, not just kind of to roll over and just kind of uh, like die and just go with the flow, just let other people direct your life. That is not what I'm advocating at all. So, so please don't try to be the person that goes with the flow. Just merely accept what happened. Just accept your situation and decide what you want and set course on that. Don't go with the flow. If you are ready to stop going with the flow, if you're not ready to just roll over and die, head over to relationshipinnergame.com and sign up there so I can show you how to get back together with the person that you love. Thanks.